page and would like to show you a trick here. I've got a normal deck of cards here. All the cards are different. I want you just to see that there's no prearrangement here, that they're not in any particular type of order. Um, whenever you feel like it, I'm going to rifle through the deck of cards and I just want you to say stop at any point. No. Okay, if you can sign your name big and bold across here. Oh, you've got a pen. That's great. I want you to make it really big and fill up as much of the space as you can because you need to be able to recognise this again if you see this later. Okay, that's great. Right, what I'm going to do is I'm going to place the cards back here and I'm going to give them a couple of cuts, first of all. And I'm going to give the deck a quick shuffle. Um, one more shuffle. In fact, how many shuffles do you want me to do? I want this to be all about free choice. <laughs> one. And the second one. We've got another choice here. I've got a ball of elastic bands and I want you just to take out any one you want. Free choice. That one. That's great. Now I'm going to magician proof the deck. That is not in the top two or three cards because we'd recognise your signature there. But I'm going to actually magician proof the deck using elastic band. I'm going to wrap the elastic round once and twice around the deck make sure that it absolutely no way that I can get to your card. Would you agree with that? So what I'm going to do is in a minute I'm just going to shake my hand and as I shake my hand the card's going to rise up through the deck but sometimes it can actually go all the way through my hand. You'll see what I mean in a minute. One, two, three. Your card, the six of spades, has travelled all the way through the deck and into the back of my hand. Thank you.